All right. Hello, everybody. I am Sophie, and I am taking over Flippy Monkey's stream right now. And I tied him back. I tied him back. Tied him up, and I put him in one of the offices. My stream now. I took it from him. Kind of stuff I do. Rebel living on edge, stealing people's streams. Let's see what I can do with other stuff. Yeah. Come, I can do things. He's fine. I'm playing Maya right now. I usually play Hisako. But, like, she's kind of hard to play. Maya is pretty. Maya is lit head. She's where it's at. Come on, yo. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. See, I'm usually, I usually play Hisako, but then I looked at the combo list and I was like, oh, was it always this hard? So now I'm playing this character. And I tried to play, um, uh, TJ Combo. Am I saying his name right? I feel like I'm saying his name wrong. Come on. Oh, damn. Didn't know she could do that, but that was not what I was trying to do. Come on. I used to play this with Preston. And he used to beat me every time. He's a monster. I should probably look at chat. <laughs> uh. Alright. Whoa, man potion just went live. Who's that? Alright, let me see. Let me let me see this stuff. Um there we go. Well, turn the volume off because I don't want to hear any of that. Oh look, it's just me, I'm the only viewer. Hey, it's like, I remember doing this. Come on. Watch. It was like, was it back? You know what I could do? I could look at the combo list. Because I know if it was Preston, he'd be like, maybe you should look at the combo list, Sophie. That's my impression of. Really sp All right, let's look at the stuff. Ah, what did I do? No. Oh no! Oh, you know why? It's because it's tangled with all these other stuff. Ben. It's not Ben's fault. I like blame him. Is it this way? Do you ever like put it in and then you're like, is that the right way in? And then you realize it's the wrong way. And then you put it in and then that's the wrong way. But then it turned out the first time was the right way. You know that stuff. Alright, is it gonna work? Nope. Put it in the wrong one. All right. Let's see. Yeah. No. Yeah. Okay. That would have been terrible. My life flashed in my eyes. Axe kick. Axe kick. Fake out. But that's how you say it, by the way. Oh, the lingo. I know things. I know all of the things. What things do you know? Praying Manta. You know, I should just... This is going to be really boring, but I should just go through all of these. I don't want to. That's not something I want to do. But this is what Preston would have me do. He had me do this since I was little. He was like, just go through all of the moves. This is my... I'm practicing with my brother. Maybe like go through all the moves. Sophie. <laughs> and then I would go through all the Because it was easier to like watch him do that, but he was just like, just practice like this. And that was my childhood. It was the worst one to say. Alright. Ooh. See the thing is, he changes. The, it feels like he's always changing the patterns in which these punches go. So right now, I cannot actually remember where light punch is. Okay, light punch, this is medium, Y. B, X. Okay, this is not hard. Kicks on the bottom, X. Or not X's. So it would go like this. Doo, doo, doo. Go! 
Nice. Freaking nerd. Okay, um. And left. Got two viewers. Nightbot's viewing this. Two man left. What are these things? Humble kick. Leap kick. God. There's so many aspects of this game that I just completely forget. Like, I get so overwhelmed, and then I just, like, I'm like, you know, whatever, I'm just gonna mash my fingers on the controller, which is probably offensive to everybody watching us. But I just, I panic. That's why people mash their fingers on a controller, because they just panic. Because every the other person looks so pristine while they're doing it. They're like, do-do-do, and, you're, you know, you're the other player, and you're like, I guess I'm gonna throw this controller into the air six times, hopefully something will happen. The psychology of noobs. <laughs> um, right. Uh, all right. Here we go, this is the one. Humble kick? No. Active, active ender. I knew this was an ender. Yeah. There we go. I've been trying to get her to do that, like, so freaking much. No. See, I really like, um, really like Maya. I really like the sock. I would say, like, in this game, I really like all the women. They're not too bad. Not too bad. What am I saying? They're, like, my, the best. They're, like, my favorite. I really like, I also just like the way Maya looks. She looks like Beyonce. I honestly feel like they modeled her on Beyonce. Like, but her build is so, like, it's Amazing! Look at this! Like, this is the kind of person you know would kick you in the face if they could, and they wanted. Like, but she'd kick you in the face, and your head would be like. You know, you're looking at all my punches and all my arrows things. She does like this consecutive blade thing. There we go. It's like boom, 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 boom. Let's see, if, let's see what I can do without those. Play as. Yeah, I should know. I should know the answer to that question. But he just, he never has like a favorite. He's just good at all of them. Here we go. He's a freaking. Yeah. I don't even know. Okay. I think the character I know the m I know the most about is Jago, and I don't even know that much. So it's better. <laughs> it's pretty good. Oh. Just like now, I have to sit here, and I have to look at all of his joke outfits. That's what fun. Like these are my joke outfits. No, let's go with the basics. 
the basic dude. I like how it's like pros and it's they're inside a like training ground. I'm like, all right, cool. That would totally happen. Let's see. Here. There we go. Typical thunder. Look at that. Look at that jazzy looking outfit too. Boom, that's an ender. Same. It's really like, really offensive to people who know this. They're probably like, who is this person? Special moves. Fun. The lingers. Same thing. Cool. So it can probably do this. Do. Oh no. What was I doing? There we go. That took a decade, holy crud. Then we can do something like this. Um, well, you do another character. Okay, down. Alright. That's just one of the variations <laughs> you can do. Oh, uh, come on. Come on, girl. Let's do this. Let's not play. Let's see how fast it is. These are more of a jump. This is like straightforward. This is like the most straightforward. Okay, I suppose I could do this and then this and then this and then this. Got it. So this and then this. 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 There we go. Holy jeez. You punch forward, kick back. Got it. So I remember what, because the combo openers and the freaking lingers are like, I guess, the hardest part. They're not really that hard. I don't know why I like that part So you punch forward, the idea. The idea we have here. Also, probably, if you want to always make the match. So, boom, boom, boom. This stuff. 
Oh. Oh my gosh, when Preston plays this game, properly flip. I hope you're prepared to be flipped, Tomaki. How are you doing, buddy? How, how's your stuff going? How's your, how's your thing? What did, you, what did you make the other day? You know what? I'm gonna go on to this. at what you made. I know Tomo uh, showed some pictures and stuff. Okay. I don't know why, but I just was like, yesterday I was like all about the donuts, you know? I was just like... Um... Oh no... The Lulu left. Um... Yeah, Wayfinder put the mad. You made soup the other day, Jackie. They do remember people putting in a lot of stuff. Oh yeah, I've been hearing about the weather in Florida. How is that going, by the way? How is that going, by the way? What is that? I don't know how to ask in a more sensitive way, because it's obviously not going very well. Like, how do you guys prepare for that kind of thing? Wait, I mean, I don't... Sorry, punch the trick. I can't believe Kalulu left. Now I feel like he's really mad that he left. He's been here for so long. In our Discord. That's so sad. I feel like personally responsible, too. Terrible as it sounds. There we go. Well, I'm glad you're doing okay. I don't know. The weather, I, I've been hearing some crazy stories about what's going on in Florida. But the thing is, I hear it from people in Los Angeles who just get it on the news. So I would rather hear it from someone who's in Florida living this, like, experience. Because it's like, you know, news is news, but I, you know, want to get the straight from the horse's mouth. The it's just like, it's, I don't know what to say. That sucks. Well, it actually a super hurricane, and it's kind of funny because the hurricane is faster than making it a cat six, but that doesn't actually. <laughs> oh, that sucks! It's like a make-believe hurricane, but not really because it's like actually happening, and everyone has to experience that. Come on, you need an, an ender to that, Sophie. Let's and it's impossible to attack. Wow. That sucks. <laughs> really sucks. Oh my god. I hope you don't get creamed by that hurricane. I hope you don't. Keep us posted, though. I would like to know what happens. On Discord, of course. That sucks. <laughs> 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 Hang on. Mm -hmm. Wrong. <laughs> Oh, 
like how the ender is just separate. Like, I didn't even... Yeah, that does sound really scary, Tomiki. Where do, are you? Your parents going somewhere? Like, you guys going to like a hotel, or are you just gonna be at home? Um, Cone Corvid, welcome to the stream. The input buffer in this game is huge, so you can input specials and button buttons way earlier than you might expect. Yes, I agree with this. <laughs> I'm not. I mean, I feel so, like, terrible saying I don't play this lot because this is way more like Preston's area. But, I, like, I've played it. There was a point where I played it a lot. And, yeah. Like, it is this... It's, like, a matter of just playing it a lot and then you know. You're like, okay, this is cool. And then, like, I can go into that. There we go. See, like, that's... <laughs> it's like <laughs> every time I do and it's funny because like I'll do it like I'll do I'll put the inputs in or whatever I'll press the buttons and then um I'll be like oh I did it too slow but then it's perfect and then I'll be like oh I did you like fast but it's perfect like it's it's so like I'm, like doing the same thing over and over again with probably you guys but there we go. I just like how he stepped on his face. His legs are way too small for his... I don't know, actually, are they? No, they're not. They seem pretty good. Yeah, I think it's just maybe I'm seeing that he looks... His legs look way too big. But, like... Oh, he's so, like, insanely just on it. Oh, I see, Tamaki. <laughs> I've been hearing that that hurricane is really hard to track. Um. Oh my god, I love the blood too. <laughs> I know, like, um. I love, I don't know, I love that, like, I love that in video games where I can just, like, punch him, blood comes out, but nothing's wrong with his face. Like, I know. What was it? I want to see Mortal Kombat, like, you can hit some, somebody and then, like, it stays on them and that's cool. But I just, I really do love that classic, like, you do this and then you wait a little bit and it goes away. Like, I don't know why I love it that much, but I just love it. It's like this really satisfying video game humor that I love. Either, like, yeah. And I love how, like, I love when you hit Dude Jake, how, like, his head just, like, flips back like that. <laughs> I don't know why. But he's always just like, oh, oh. Whereas, like, if this was really happening, we would just be, we'd be dead. Like, that would, that is such an insane punch. It's like, he's breaking the sound barrier when he punches him in the face. Stomps on his head and <laughs> the blood is just, like, spewing out like 10 feet into the air. I just, I love that. Everything is dramatic except nothing happens to the character. And like, you look here when I kick him in his <laughs> I just love how he throws his head back. I don't know why. Because it feels like, you know what it is? It feels like such a small reaction to such a big thing. Like he's like punching him with all of his strength and Jago's just like, ah. Oh. <laughs> Which obviously he'd have to be, because if he like had a full reaction, playing one match would take like a good twenty years to get over. So he has to have like this ah uh, okay. It's like what <laughs> oh, I love fighting games. My brother, um I have two older brothers. The youngest of seven. So I have two older brothers. Um, and Preston is the oldest in our family, and he and my brother, Corey, they're both my older brothers, but like six times, I don't know why I have to reiterate it, they were like, um, <laughs> they were like, um, 
they would have like game, like Preston played Killer Instinct. That was his, and then Corey would play Mortal Kombat, and he was like, he used to play Katana a lot. Preston, I don't know what he plays in this. I don't think he has a main. I think he just he's really good at all of them. He can do a pretty mean Jago. He could just take all the characters and go nuts. But when TJ wasn't hard to play, <laughs> sorry, I say hard to play. People might be like, oh, he's easier to play now. Hard to play for me. But when he was hard, when he was easier to play, Preston was nuts. I mean, he probably still is. I just haven't seen him play this. Sorry. One, two. Um. Yeah, the, the Indian character is quite literally red. Um, I don't know. Yeah, yeah. He also looked really red on stream. Which is funny because I think I look really orange on stream. <laughs> so I don't know what that is. But he is kind of more bronze, if I feel. Um, but I heard they really tried to make a very accurate portrayal of a Native American. So I don't know if what happened was they like input and put it, put in the colors and then he just came out like super red and they were like oh or i don't know but i know they try their best because when i look at maya i quite think i literally think she looks like beyonce but with freckles like probably lighter skin because she's very solid she's got like proportioned more proportions like than beyonce um but She's like a very solid girl and like super gorgeous. Like when she kicks someone, you're like, ugh. If she was real, that would really hurt. Cause her kicks are just like a freaking like a powerhouse. But I really like like I really like um I really like Tisaka. I don't know why I don't know how to play her anymore. You know why? It's they stopped practicing. It's so hard to play this game with Preston. I mean, I'm not saying it's all his fault, but I'm saying it's all his fault, guys. Um. <laughs> um. Yeah. Okay. Probably shouldn't say that. But it's been said. Too late. Who else is okay? Let me. See. I was gonna say she will. Wow, Saber Wolf. I could do Saber Wolf. I can't, I don't, I don't know why, but with the robots or the aliens, I'm really bad. So I cannot do Glacius. You know why? It's because he feels really slow to me and I just, I get angry and I'm like, it's, all, it's the character. It's not me, but it's me. Um, oh, what's this? Oh, what? Oh, do I have to do something? Oh, hang on. No, 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 no. We're cool. We're cool. We're cool. Idol, idol, idol. Oh, come on, see, let's get that together. Can't do this. Can't do. I can do kind of Kim Wu. I think I stopped playing Kim Wu because I was kind of trying to play her, and then Preston was like, "Let me teach you how to play Kim Wu," and then he beat me with another Kim Wu, and I was just very bitter and salty, and I was like, "I will never play this character." Stupid! I hate everybody. So then I stopped playing her, which is a very mature decision on my. Part. Oh my gosh, my favorite person. Oh, she's so amazing. Like, who doesn't look at this dinosaur and just, like, automatically want to be best? Look how cute she is. She's like a cat. I don't know why she reminds me of my cat. Does. <laughs> when he eats a lot of meat, then he gets red. Well, there are people that I have met that are actually red, but like super red, and it's because they have a lot of iron, ton of iron in their blood. Wait, seriously? Is that really a thing? People who have a lot of iron in their blood? Is red? Is that a dumb question to ask? I didn't know that. I want to look that up. I'm going to look that up, because I want to know, like, could I eat a but I don't eat a lot of, you know what? I'm orange. And I'm not orange in real life. Very a very brown color especially when i'm in the sun some people tan like in like like a crispy play you know i just burn in terms of color just like a, a an okay look steak 
is how I would describe my skin color. <laughs> but, um, that's crazy. He could act. He, I mean, he does look kind of. You know, like, now that you said that he looked red, I cannot. Now I'm. And I can't stop. Also, look at the veins on that person. Hello, James Rogers. Um. Thank you for the. This is. You're gonna get. You, all of you are gonna just be offended, but for the purple diamonds. I don't know what that is. You know what? Keep it between us. I don't know what that is. You guys wanna tell me what that is? That'd be cool. Because I feel, I know it's important, and I'm really like, thank you for giving me the, these diamonds comment. I don't know what that is. Like, what are you giving us? What a weird question. It is. If you guys are asking yourselves, how does she work at this place? <laughs> I don't know. I just showed up one day and they're like, here, here's a controller. Play this game. Look how she, like, bites at her tail. All right. Oh, she's so cute. Look at this. Who even is this girl? She's just amazing. Talk about, like, beauty. What am I trying to think? Unreachable beauty standards. Look at this. Look at this. Look how cute she is. Don't tell me you guys are just not like the like dinosaur. I thought she was adorable. They're bits. Okay, new okay, I know what a bit is. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Thanks, James, for the bed. That's really nice of you. I mean, I don't want to brag, but afterwards, I'm going to go up to everybody and be like, yeah, I did one stream and I got that, so, whatever. Okay, cool. Uh, yay! That would make sense if we got I think we will. I d I'm not... Ben is really on top of it. He's usually the guy. I mean, I blame everything on him when things go wrong, because it's just super easy to, you know? Ben, what I say? I there. But, there's one about Twitch. Also, what is her tail made out of? Is that wood? Is that plastic? Look at this thing. It's got to be, like, cybernetic. Ugh. It looks like it's, like, skin. Wow. Like, terrible thing. I should look at the clueless. Command list. <laughs> Sophie, do you know what games are? No, I have no idea what I'm doing. Very right, combo openers. I is basic. <laughs> oh. So punches go this way. And so does kick, apparently. Everything goes that way. There we go. That's what I'm going to do. The noise gate. I'm sorry, you think about the sure. Do we need to adjust the noise? Let me just play it on my phone. Oh, I see. Yeah. You know what? I want to say it's because I'm loud. Or I'm loud. I'm quiet. <laughs> it's like silent. When I'm playing it, so I can like barely feel it here or talk. Oh my god! Triple. All right, let's change this character. Um, it's weird. It sounds okay on my phone, but.
can't. It's so weird to see myself on stream. I don't know if you guys have that experience, but... What do you... James, what do you need me to change? Is it the game that I need to change? In terms of volume? Or is it me? Like, am I too loud? Why do I do this to myself? It's like an abusive, like, self-abusive relationship. I'm always like, oh, I can't play Hisako. She's too difficult. But then I just, this voice in my mind is like, play her. You want the struggle. You want the struggle. This is the kind of hat I need. All right. <laughs> Okay, I'm too quiet. I see. I need to project. I was a quiet child. Um, that's actually not even a joke. I was a quiet child. And I'm just starting to rem rem remember that Jaco's face is always covered. My life. That's what I do. Easily amazed by small details. <laughs> uh, Alright, I'm gonna do this and then I'm gonna play my... Uh, not Maya. Thunder. In a battle against a uh, creature. Oh, that's right. He's a jumper. He blows. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I want to say this is how you. Oh no. Is it her punches that are forward? Like, why do I even bother? I, this was the first character I played when I started the stream. <laughs> I'm struggling. <laughs> I'm struggling in a make-believe situation. Times two. Got it. Combo openers. Combo linkers. This is what I do. I just pick, like, a general thing. I'll be like, okay, punch. So then I could punch back. Combo opener. And punch back again. That's also a linker. <laughs> and then I can super punch back. Great, done. <laughs> Go like this. And, oh, you know what? Great, she does like a weird. Done, right? That's an ender. Do this, do that. And then I get bored and I'm like, wait a minute, it's kind of boring. Really messed up. Like, you know, you just you get into the psychology of these people that aren't real people. What am I doing? <laughs> psychology of these people that aren't real people. I feel like they made her thing shorter. I remember dragging on the ground. I remember she goes like this. That's right. You don't want to like see up her skirt. Why isn't Preston? I know that's what I'm going to Preston's a tool. <laughs> Hang on, uh, my still... Oh, thank you for giving me the rest of your bits, James. How is, uh, university? I started school as well. But that's not going to be as interesting to talk about. So let's talk about you. <laughs> talk about your experiences. Oh, come on. Yeah. There we go. I wonder if I can play basketball. With oh, hang on. on. There we go. Hang on. Sometimes you could like bounce these people like a basketball. There we go. Oh, you know what? I can't remember if it's like. Yeah, that's what it is. Oh, I keep getting this mixed up with like other games like Naruto and stuff. 
where it's like it changes everywhere you go but in this it's like it's nope same direction same stuff and the punches are different oh here we go um, that easy to learn never mind she doesn't know how to play the fighting game no i don't know how to play fighting games have three math lectures per week yeah you do oh um, yeah <laughs> i wonder what made you think i didn't know how to play fighting games wonder what what gave you that idea I just, I really wonder. No, I don't know how to play fighting games. <laughs> how was your math class? What math are you taking? I'm taking, um, <laughs> taking algebra 2. I don't want to brag, but... <sighs> I'm really bad at math. I cannot handle it. Okay. Let me see. No, let's reset this thing. I don't know what I'm. Okay, here we go. Um, okay. with numbers and stuff <laughs> way better than me I'll tell you don't have to give me compliments no I'm not bad I'm pretty good and I'm a pretty quick learner um, but I guess it just doesn't help that I'm a girl I think that's the real problem guys um, you're doing a lot of things with numbers and stuff Pretty sure they added the alphabet at some point. Yeah, yeah, they added the alphabet, and then they decided that there were things called integers that happened within the numbers, and then there's rational numbers, and then there's irrational numbers, and then there's such things as imaginary numbers, which is a load of hogwash. Let me just tell you, I took a, I remember taking a class, and the teacher would let you just open up the class with, we won't be taking, we won't have imaginary numbers in this class, and then like. A month into the class, she's like, okay, imaginary numbers. And I'm like, this is crap. I hate imaginary numbers. I don't even really remember them. I just remember hating them a lot. All right, let's, I'll do this there. Uh, yeah. Oh. Um... <sighs> All right. Master, I'm through with skills. Any team is super good. Yeah, it's pretty epic. Um, mm. Huh? 
Come on. Over here. Dude, it actually says, like, keep you. Oh my god. Continue your quest. No, I'm not going to mess up that for Preston. He can do that himself. Um, all right. Turn your skills with a variety of whatever. All right, we'll do this. Oh, thunder. It's thunder! I like how that's like how he walks. He's just like, boom, boom, I'm here. Okay. Orchid. He's pretty basic, too. Got your basic characters. Fast character. Feel the most comfortable. Go with the, you go with the fast character. What do I go with? Um... Jeez. I, I guess I just go with, like... I don't know. Because he's... What, he's not, like, slow. Yeah, I guess. No, because you can just do this and you can do that. So it's... Yeah, I know, Preston! Oh my gosh, he's like yelling things at me. I know what I'm supposed to do, I just can't do it. <laughs> so it's boom, boom. Boom, 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 and then finisher. Boom! He doesn't know how to play fighting games. Yeah, fight me in real life, buddy. I can play a goddamn fighting game. Called, uh, my brother has played it. That's what? Okay. Um, you know what? The fast characters really scare me. And I think it's because, like, I just get this, like, out of control feeling and I start losing control of them. Like, slow, I just like good paced, solid characters, I guess. Although, yeah, because I like, I don't know, is Bayonetta considered fast? Because Bayonetta's pretty good on Smash. And I like to use, um, uh, Kirby as well. Um, yeah. You got it? Well, I can't say it my email address now, so, okay. <laughs> Can you even press the button? All right, cool. Sorry, I'm talking to Ben. If you guys just thought I was crazy, that was not the situation. Oh, he's sending me a link to the Adobe Photoshop. How do you guys like the postcards? Because I have been drawing those and I can't afford Photoshop. So Ben just gave me Photoshop and I have been drawing them on this like discount freaking um Come on. On this discount like online thing. I play Granny G, Roy, Corin, Cannon, and Mega Man. I've not played all those, um, or all those, any of those. Oh, thanks. Yeah, I hope they, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not a great artist, but I'm, I like to think I'm easy. 
Come on. There we go. <laughs> Do it separately and it looks good, but no, not what I wanted. Okay, see, like a fair fight in this game would be like me against someone who kind of knows it, so it's like me against me. <laughs> that would be like me playing god, who like kind of not Preston because he knows the game, doesn't kind of know it. Be like, yeah. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> That's really messed up. <laughs> That's something that happens to <laughs> Blue Moon. <laughs> What have I been- I've been watching this show, um, this BBC show that I used to watch as, like, 13 after school, and it was called Jonathan Creek, or it is called- actually, I don't know if it's still out. It comes back every once in a while, but I was re-watching it, and there was, like, one episode where this character- or they're looking for this killer. It's a mystery series. I'm just jumping around. It's a mystery series, and they're looking for this killer. And they describe the killer as been having worn a like a raccoon, raccoon skin um, hat, like the Davy Crockett hat, and you see the shadow of it in like like a shot or something. And every time, like I remember watching it, I was rewatching it just net recently, and I was like, oh my god, and I had this like horrible chill because when I was younger and I watched this show, it scared the crap out of me. Like I was just emotionally ruined by the show but i loved it which was weird i had this like self-abusive relationship self-inflicted i think they say but it just it was oh my god i just remember i was like oh i had to pause it because it was just so traumatizing and it just it ruined my life i don't even know why i watched it again i mean the intro was the the Dance Macabre by um, Camille Saint Saëns. Um, in the in in like that song used to just creep me out. It was like the introduction to X Files. Like, oh, you are you getting random ads? Yeah, I've been getting random ads as well while watching Quit. On on my phone actually mainly. If I'm gonna be honest. But it's so. I always thought you get ads when you already, like, you tune in once, like, the first time, then you get an ad. Clearly not. But anyway, talk about childhood traumas. Clearly, that is on par with some pretty gruesome stuff. But I just, I don't know why, I just, oh. Why do I do that to myself? Like, I watch these horrible shows, and, like, I watched Hellraiser recently, and I'm like, I'm gonna just, this is gonna ruin my life. But I did it. It didn't really ruin my life, but you know, I was aware of this. You know what really ruined me was um, it with what's his name? Not the new one, with Tim Curry. Oh my god, that was terrible. I'm only talking about this because Halloween's coming up, and I was talking to a child the other day, not just like some random. I was babysitting, and they were like talking. She's like, "Oh, I love Halloween. It's all the decorations." And then this fear just crept on me, and I'm like, "Oh my god." Like, I, I can kind of handle gore. Like, I can handle it. Like, I don't like, but it's like, whenever it's like a scene where you don't know what the monster looks like, that really gets me. Like, a lot. A lot. I had such an active imagination as a child that I would, I would just think up these, like, horrible things. 
I okay. This is this is personal. Let's keep it between us, guys. Let's not let it leave this room. But when I was little, I was so like scared of these freaking like idea that this monster would come into my room. Like I remember watching those like sci-fi um, nature program things, like on Discover, not Discovery, but on the History freaking channel, and it would be like you know Bigfoot. And as a kid, I thought it was totally possible that Bigfoot would come into my room one day. Like, like this was a probable thing. Like, this could happen. First of all, Bigfoot would have to walk within the daylight to actually have gotten into my house, if you think about it. Because I live in, like, a suburban area. And people would find him. But as a child, I was so real. I was like, he's going to come into my room and I'm going to die. So I made this pack. I'm going to I'm going to keep going with the story till then. But I made this pack with my dolls. I had American Girl dolls. Uh James, you probably don't know what those are, but they're like these dolls that come from different parts of American history. And I made a pack. I was like, "Guys, when I go to sleep, you have to ward all the evil away and I will be okay." And it was okay since then because clearly what I needed to do was trick myself into convincing the situation was not real. I was struggling in a situation that was already not real. And then I had to solve it with another situation that was that was also not real. It was just my imagination can make me become this self-destructive human being. And I don't know why, but it's so real to me. Like, oh my god. Like, I think it's an actual possibility, like, that a house... I mean, I yeah, I think a house could be haunted. Like, if you asked me now, I'd be like... Like, I don't know what's wrong with me, James. I have no idea what's wrong with me. <laughs> but uh, oh, it's still there, like, in the back of my mind. Like, if I get into, like, yeah, like, I think a house could be haunted. Like, genuinely, if you asked me, I'd be like, no, not possible. But if I was in a house alone and I heard a noise, I would be like, it's haunted. Or there's witches. Or someone's going to murder me, so I might as well just, you know, accept it now. And my biggest fear, my my biggest fear is if I like get get married and we get a house, my biggest fear is that the house will be haunted. Okay, who cares about sewage leaking or pipes bursting or cockroaches in the house? If the house is haunted, like this is a real thing. If a house is haunted, then it's like a nightmare because if we really like if you get into that reality like it's possible for something to be haunted 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 and then it's haunted like how do you prove that to the people who sold you the house like this place is do you see what i'm saying here it's just it really it freaky gets it gets me <laughs> this is a reality in my world i don't know why i just have this problem but it's so you know what when i was little i'm pretty sure it was either preston or corey one of my brothers just like put on a dream mask dude this is the kind of stuff that happened in my household and one day they just chased me down a hallway i just oh my god it was like so traumatizing and i was so small and like cute and innocent oh still am but <laughs> it was like so real to me and we used to for halloween we used to put on like a show for the trick-or-treaters like we used to dress up scare them and like now that i think about it that's also terrible yeah exactly exactly tamaki exactly you sit there you're in the daylight you're with your friends you're like ghosts whatever but you're in your house and it's dark you will drop the reality you live in in a hot minute when you hear a noise that should not have been made, okay? And it's so real. Like, I'll be just in my room just, like, reading a book or anything, and then I'll hear a noise, and I'm like, I'm gonna die. <laughs> Instantly, I'm going to die. <laughs> and then it's like, uh, the unknown, the unknown just, like... And it's so weird, because sometimes I won't even be, like, watching a scary movie. I'll just sit there and think of something horrible. Like... Oh my gosh. Oof. I can't even imagine. I can't even imagine, like, what it was like to be my parent. Oh no, you know what? I never... 
I usually, I think I took it on the chin. I don't think I ever went to my mom. And I was like, there's ghosts. But she believed in ghosts. She still does. So I could really have just gone up to her and she'd be like, that's grounded. Let's we can stay in, in, with your parents tonight or whatever. But no. I just, I just stiff up her lip. I just took it. And my dad was like very strict, like German. So he would be like, don't waste the electricity so <laughs> i like the when the light in my bedroom I, I had to have it on the whole time but my parents like they didn't even give me a plug they were just like no you don't just turn it off so i would just be in my room in the dark pretending to sleep oh my gosh and like whenever you sleep as a kid and then one of your legs is out of the covers i'm like there's gonna be an arm who's gonna that's gonna grab it and I'm just gonna be dead and then I have to will all of my things to my dog. Ugh, it's terrible. You know, the usual stuff. So that being said, <laughs> when I was little, Preston and Corey, my brothers, used to play Mortal Kombat all the time. So I think that's why I'm not as terrified when it comes to war and stuff. Have you guys ever heard of, um... Because I actually feel good in the dark, but I have a fear. You know what, Tamagi? That has also happened to me as well. I mean, like, if, if I'm in the dark for a while and my mind is going off, then I'll just freak out. But I also do feel safer in the dark sometimes. But I'm also one of those, like, all or none, nothing claustrophobes where it's, like, not really claustrophobic. But if I'm going to be in a room with a closed door, it has to be dark and like everything needs to be shut but if i'm gonna be in a room and the lights on everything needs to be open like it's all or nothing and i also get really nervous if i'm in like a big area with lots of people i don't know why i just i just get this. um but it's not as uncommon as i thought people see the yeah yeah i don't think that is that's pretty common i know a lot of people who are like who are like that, who are just like, set the door, lights off, we're cool, like, safe. <laughs> Home base, like, nothing can happen to me here. Um, lights hurt you, James, yeah, I know, you're a vampire. I mean, I don't want to generalize, but like, everyone in Scotland's a vampire. That's not true. Oh my god, can you imagine? You should lie, you should tell me right now that everyone in Scotland is a vampire, and I'd be like, yeah, okay. <laughs> Hi, Ducky! Hi! Matt Hole is here today, and so is his dog. Obviously the dog. Higher by rank. The dog. <laughs> uh, I have everything on night mode. How has your heart been lately? Or heart? Heartburn been lately. I know you have terrible heartburn. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I like how I do the finisher three seconds after the whole combo. What is wrong with me? Come on. <sighs> Pretty good. There you go. Seconds later. Seconds later. Okay. Let's do it, like, right this time. Let's try and do it like a normal human being. Cripples me every night. I should go to the doctor. You should go to the doctor. Um, very just random question you don't have to like is that you can go for free right you don't need like insurance it's all state paid isn't it unless you do like private but you have public health care i i think i'm not sure i used to think that i got bad panic attacks on large groups of people but apparently it's just my body talking 
taking in all the electricity from around me because it gets the same feeling in a room full of electronics. That's interesting. I don't get that. Well, maybe. Um, I don't know. No, this room's filled with electronics. It's not like I'm sure. You know, I know I don't know if I've ever I don't think I've ever had a panic attack. Um, I've seen girls have panic attacks and I, I went to an all girls school and it was private, so there was a lot of panic attacks. I don't know. I just assume it's common because they're super stressed out all the time. <laughs> But I didn't have any. One girl had a terrible panic attack at my school, at my high school. She, they had to call the ambulance. She just like threw up. It was during a final, an AP final. This is why I never had panic attacks, because I wasn't smart enough to be in AP classes. <laughs> but yeah, I was told I could have been, and then I had to take a standardized test. It was really stupid. Um. Oh, so you get you have no excuse, Rogers. Yeah, go see the doctor. I just I feel like maybe I don't know. I I know my sister used to like drink um baking soda mixed with water. Um, not not aluminum, and she'd drink it, and then she'd chase it down with vinegar. That's what she said she did for Harper. But that's not a doctor, so I don't want to sit there and give you that advice. Like you die or something like that'd be terrible. I don't want to be. I don't want to be in charge of your death. That would be horrible. Yeah. What? 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 Should be playing Rocket League later, guys. All right. James is gonna be playing Rocket League because he is James. That's the only reason why. No other reason. Let's see if I can, um, let's see how, uh, let's see what I can do. I want to play Naruto, to be honest. Why do I always like the games that either, like, are too... Um, there we go. Yes, I am good. Thank you for asking. That was Ben. Or the voice in my head. <laughs> Bunch of other electronic related stuff. Um, I've explained before, my mom and I have a condition where we take in all the electricity from us, but unfortunately that means, hey, I call my phone in a matter of minutes, and I can't have a credit card because I'm so good. Also, a bunch of other electricity related stuff to help because I'm super full. have a lot of- Oh my gosh! Full circle, Tom Key! We were just talking about iron, and now we went back to it. But also, that is strange. That is very strange. I've never heard of that. And I'm not saying I don't believe you. I just mean like, I've never heard of that until now. And that is crazy. And I could imagine what it is like to explain that to people. Like, because it's so, like, that disease sounds so insane that it almost sounds like sci-fi, sci science fiction-y, you know? So I could imagine when you have to explain that to people. But also, that would be a really dope power to have if you could amplify it, you know? Just like you hate someone, boom, your phone's dead. Then you leave. Because you're not, you're not harming them, you're just killing their phone. And causes terrible AIW. Awkward. Invertebrated window solutions. <laughs> what is AIW? Yeah, people never believe- See, I- Cause I can- I can believe that people wouldn't. James is playing Rocket League right now. He's a cool cat. Actually, I was thinking this- Thinking this? I- Yeah, I was thinking the other day. I know, guys. Oh. Let's not hold our breath here. 
But I was thinking, um, because you were, you showed us a picture of your, um, um apartment? No, it's more like, um, you showed us the picture of your dorm. And I was like, where does he put his game console? And that was my, that was the thought I had. I was like, where does he put his game console? So, all of you guys sit there and be amazed by the thoughts that I have. I kill people's phones all the time. That is so crazy. Now I want, now I want to, now I can't wait until you come here because I'm going to be like, I'm going to be like, what's he, is he, you know, like, I'm going to hold my phone out and be like, all right. And like, time it. You should time it. Game consoles? Game consoles? Do I sound like an idiot? Oh, okay. All right. See. Someone's a king. King James. Alice in Wonderland. Oh, Alice in Wonderland syndrome. Yeah. Um, my niece had that when she was really little. Is that when your, your like, um, pupil goes like this? Because I remember when she was little, they were going to get my sister was going to give her glasses. But it was weird, so she was just like, I'm going to just wait. <laughs> and then when that stops, we'll get her glasses. We should do a Naruto tournament. I'm just kidding. I don't want to do a Naruto tournament because if I have to watch people play Naruto, I'm going to feel like super inadequate. Cry myself to sleep for the rest of my life. So oh. My mom's really good at playing these games. So that's a really random thing to say, but she's pretty sturdy at it. Just like it's one of those things where like, hey mom, play it. Okay. That was an, that was me trying to be my. But my brain has adapted to it. I'm like, oh, wow, I feel really bad. Like, what does it feel like though? Explain the feeling that you go through when you're like sucking in all of the electric, like super, like the, the dude in um, X Men First Class who like sucks in explosions. This is this is how I paint you. In my mind, comic game. Oh, that sucks. All right, what am I doing? Um, Zara. Zara is my main. Back up. I also cannot tell who he is. Is these characters? Okay. Let's make him look spiffy. Oh, kind of. Whatever. Band prison? Why not? But it does come out of yeah. Tell me. Tell me how it feels. I want to know. Because like I, I don't know, like I is it tingly? Is it like when um you shock yourself? Is that how it feels? Or is it like slow and numbing or is it pain? on your skin. like when when you your your like leg goes to sleep or your hand goes to sleep and then you feel it tingle is that is that what it feels like I don't know giving you these these options um. yeah the other day I was going over some trivia questions with my um family. This is American history. Oh, wait. Imagine being able to feel. Oh, whoops. Let's just actually play this game, Sophie. Oh, whoops. Yeah. Okay, never play one game and then go into another hoping that you're gonna actually make it difference here. It's a lot different. Oh, hang on. How do I jump? Oh, I remember we changed it. How do we change it? I can convert my body. Oh, but... Yeah, that sounds... Um, 
I forgot how to play this game. Oh my gosh, that's the worst feeling. This is like one of my favorite games. This is like embarrassing. Sorry guys. I'm embarrassed because this is something I'm supposed to be good at. Okay. Oh, that's right. There's like a crap ton of bees. Sand burial. This game, I haven't played it in such a long time that actually looking at the moves can, like just confounds boulders in my mind. Yeah. No, nope, still not getting it. There we go, here we go. Power to open the way to the future. Hey, kiddo, you have like then I'm like, oh god no. I'm filled with energy. Feels weird. Gotta look this up. That sounds crazy. Now I'm thinking about this like thunderstorm that's coming your way in Florida. Are you just gonna like absorb all of the like I just thought of a really great comic series that we could write about you. Comic E and the Electrum Flying Currents. Probably should have looked at what I was doing when I was playing this character. Hang on, let me look at this. Let me <laughs> let me learn how to play this game. Um, up, down, up, down. Tilting B. Software load. Why, why? Yeah, that's it. Oh my gosh. Damn it. Come on, Sakura. Like, let's not be a douche. Yo, girl, come on. Like, be nice here. How's this? Why? Why the thing? That was interesting. Thank you. Okay. Feels weird. Go ahead. Look it up. And you will be. I can only ever find stuff out. Assume you get a lot of like for that like, reason. I am not because it really does. It sounds so insane that it like I'm starting to question all aspects of my current reality. But you know, it is quite possible. <laughs> like some freaking super crazy awesome 
I'm not gonna lie though. Knowing this, I am very concerned now that there's a thunderstorm heading your way. <laughs> It's so oh, now that you talked about using fast characters, and I'm noticing I just use like nice paced characters. Cause I used to never use Dara in the PSP version because he was so slow. It was like he was on tranquilizers. It was just insane. I was like, I can't even handle this guy too much. Oh no! Oh, that was good. That was good. Touche, computer. Touche. Got me on that one. Why do I always get her in those? So much, Sophie. Whoa, hey. He used it like three times right after he said that. Come on. Straight up, sit there and be like. Also, I'm not you, so I don't know. Like, I don't know what that feels like to get the Alexis Alexis card and then tell someone, and then they're like, "You're lying. You're just making it up." So I couldn't imagine like what that's like. But I want to look. At How do you know you have it though? Like, if you don't have digits, did you have like, did you need a doctor or something, or is it like you just sat there and you're like? This is a nightmare. And what- Oh, also, what happened the first time, like, you had to deal with that? What was that like? I want to know. Because, like, I want to know... I, mean, I want to know, like, where were you? Were you, like, in public? Were you just like, oh, what's happening? You were just, like, a kid, and you're like... No, what am I doing? See, now I'm remembering how I used to play this, and so now it makes a little bit of sense now. Because um, I used to do this, and then I would like go YYB. And it would work, but clearly not. There we go, that's how you do it. Take this. Get out of the way. Oh, I don't remember when the opportune moment was. Like right when I finish a combo? The victor has been decided. 
I'll use this power to yeah. open the way to the future. And we can both play against another person in this game. Am I reading this wrong? One player versus two player. Nice. This is one versus computer, one versus two. That's weird. Unless, what did I do? Team match, here we go. No, that's whatever. Okay. You're hilarious, game. My job is playing video games. I'm not that great. Obviously. I feel like you're trying to make a joke here. I don't appreciate Actually, my job is to play video games. <laughs> it's to organize people who play video games. But, um... No, I should be good at it by now, but the only game I'm seeing to be really good at is, um, Naruto. Why? Because I freaking love this game <laughs> so much. That's good. Oh, I hate, like, basic characters. They're not bad, they're great characters. Because I have a fancy character that I'm playing. Sucks. No, I don't, like, I guess my job is a collection of different jobs. <laughs> um, because I'm not very, it's disappointing to say I'm not very good. No, I'm good. I'm great, not fantastic, is what I would say. Um, this looks interesting, let's go there. Weeb. Yeah, I am a weeb. Archer's a thing, you know what I'm saying? Oh, what? Oh, that happens. I'm so used to using a different set of controls that when I have to use this control. Double jump, death, rebound, up charge, third.
The ninjutsu. No, I'm trying to think. How do I? How do I do it? How do I change? Oh, how do I forget this? I, I, I figured it out while playing, so I can figure it out while playing again. Wow. It's no use. Oh, that's how I did it. This way. Haha! <laughs> okay. It's cool. I remember now. <laughs> My job is being Sophie, that's my job. Really? <laughs> you think it would be easy, but apparently I struggle at the easy things. Come on, girl, you wanna, wanna play? We can play. I am a I really like Naruto. I know we were Tomaki, we were talking about favorite anime, but. Dane? What are your favorite anime? You have to have obviously had some animes that you like. Watch. Sorry, right. sorry, right. walk it off, buddy. Sorry, <laughs> right. we have fire. Why are you like this? Let's just, let's just leave the guy I can actually. Or not. Okay, in a team, we have the Naruto character that everyone needs to understand that that's what I play all the time. Oh, girl. Of course they pick like the team of the most deadliest women to play against. <laughs> like, no, this is cool. Let me just let me just play these characters. You know, it's it's not them. It's them. Yay, I finally got to see- Wow, okay. <laughs> that escalated quickly. Thank you. I'll so leave the rest to you. I'm gonna surpass all of the Hokage who came before me. That's my dream. No deal. That was not a struggle at all for me. That was the hardest thing I've ever had. Is there a Bleach game? There should be a Bleach. I play like. Yeah, rematch. One A. One A. My team effort. Okay, obviously not gonna get it if I'm looking like a dude. Come on, girl. Let's just let's not do this game right now. 
All right, let's see if this useless character that I cannot play can do what I need him to do. Yeah, maybe just I need a slower character because when they're too fast, I can't mash my hands against the thing and pretend I know what I'm doing. character I can play. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Come on. Come on, bro. Uh, Time to settle the score. It's alright. It's alright. Walk it off, buddy. Walk it off. Come on. Let's do this. I can do this. I can freaking do this. Wow. Barely made that, guys. Barely won that game. Oh, hello, uh, Garion. How you doing? Had true pizza in two years because I'm gluten free. By God, dang, I missed that. Wow, this is, this, that's emotional. People are talking about pizza in the chat. Emotion. Pizza is a. Oh my gosh. Crazy discovery. Last night I was getting donuts. I don't want to, don't ask any more questions. I was getting donuts and I realized there are so many donut places around where I live. And I don't know if this is common, like in America, every five feet of this country, we have donuts everywhere, but there were donut shops everywhere and pizza shops everywhere. And I was like, is that just what we do? Do we just eat donuts and pizza all the time? There's so many of them. PH and PJ is that the PH uses super fatty pepperoni which makes everything greasy AF and also has the best tan uh, you live in a donut desert god bless America that's what I'm gonna say you live in a donut desert I imagine like um a desert and this is where I imagine where you live that's shaped like a donut you live on the like the, the round part of the donut, and there's donuts everywhere. <laughs> That's what I imagine. <laughs> Which is totally not accurate at all, but I'm gonna pretend That's where you live. That's kind of human being I am. Instantly, we have this team. Gosh, it's like when I play the computer, it's like they actually just, you know, it's like they're playing the game. They like to take my time. Okay, see? I'm gonna get out of the way here, Sophie. Like, I say C, and like, like I'm gonna show you the thing, but really, you're just watching me kill myself. This is crap. Freaking team playing players. How dare you use all of your players, computer? Sorry, Jane, I will leave your comments, but I am like, ready to murder, so. Nice. Okay. I remember the episode in Naruto where they learned how to walk up water. 
I remember that. Oh, I watched the Death Note movie the other day. Anybody seen it? I want you to make an opinion before I make my opinion and when everyone dies, though. So. Not that it's a terrible opinion. You know what? Just share with me if you guys have seen it. Maybe you can do a movie night. Where I do that, I'm sorry. Maybe a movie night. Um, okay, let me read. There's a lot of few desert in Topeka, but in my area there's like no donut places dedicated to places that cook from fresh to order within a couple miles. Oh, that sucks. That really sucks. I don't count the gas stations that have delivered donuts and am because they get old. Yeah, yeah. No, those aren't. Everyone agrees that that is not a donut. Um where everything is super healthy for you and makes you feel good, but it's the driest thing you will ever eat. Tomaki says, make your opinion. Okay, I have not seen any notes of death, live action or otherwise. I feel like the movie would not be close. It's not close to the original. And I had to separate, I guess, my feelings about it because it wasn't a very good movie on its own. And it also just wasn't, if like, like if I was just watching it, without thinking about the anime. It just wasn't good because it ended weird. Um, and the part where it kind of gets really um, Guy Ritchie, you know, like how Guy Ritchie and his, you know, his films will like have something happen and then he explains like how this whole complicated process occurred, like in Snatch or like, um, you know, just like those movies that he did. And, but if it's like, but this, this, I don't know, they didn't, they didn't, it didn't, it didn't, it wasn't, like, significant. And the ending was just, like, kind of meh, you know? Like, it faded off of it. Like, it was supposed to be cool, but I don't know what it was that made it weird. Um, so I didn't like it. But I don't, I don't want people to just be like, ah, oh, it's terrible, it's just dopey. Not that you think my opinion matters, my opinion matters that much, but... Um, I got an S, which I think is better than an A. And yeah, I just, I don't know. I, I really love the manga. I kind of feel like um, when people outright remake animes, they tend to have a harder time. And I think it's almost better to just use an anime as a foundation without openly expressing that it's anime. So like Inception was basically Paprika, but he didn't, call it pepper eating you know because i feel like you know if christopher nolan had done that people would be like well let me see the anime and they'd compare it the whole time whereas he just took aspects of it and then created something else entirely which i think is both creative and respectful because you know that just i feel like that's just kind of how it should work with anime because we're never we're just ne it's never going to be right there's always going to be like half a dozen million bajillion people who are just like well that is myself. So I personally believe that if you redo an anime or you remake it, you try and either leave it up to the Japanese or, um, you know, like, do what I just said. Just use it as a foundation. Because it's, it's just, I don't know. Because Ghost of the Show, I thought, was better than Death Note. Really good, really solid, good stuff. But then, obviously, there was some things that people didn't agree with and the safest way to make a movie i think is to just like or make a movie based on the anime like i said like how chris fernal and did its inception it did really well and it was you know he took elements from an anime not you know not disrespecting his creativity he totally was creative throughout that entire process that's what i like about it and it's, it just, it really is, it's like, it's so hard. I honestly, I can't imagine what it's like to be told, like, here's an anime, now you have to make it into, like, a, a film. Because it, it's just hard. I know I couldn't do it. I know I can, obviously, I don't have any directing skills whatsoever. But even if someone came up to me with all the knowledge I know of Naruto and how much I love it, and they're like, are right, you in charge of Naruto? I'd be like, no, like don't. That's the best way you can remake Naruto, not take aspects of it. 
what do you have? A girl, two guys, two guys having this basically this love quarrel, and they all are super ninjas. Boom. This this is it. Does it sound like it's a Super ninjas and then super ninjas. Also, Sasuke is not working for me. Holy oh, I had Tomate. That was who I had. And I just put it on the opposite team. Way to go, Sophie. You really messed that one up. Okay, not the guy I wanted. <laughs> But yeah, I don't know, like... The... Did anyone ever read that now? Because I know Gary Nee said you haven't. And... Tommy G, you didn't play. I don't know if Reddit works. And I never, like, I never like to blame the actor for certain, like, decisions that are made. For instance, you know, it is a huge deal that these characters aren't being played by Japanese people. And I understand that concern, like, I totally get it. But... I'm Mick Grave, and I never sit there and ever, I'm like, why aren't there black, Korean, Chinese, German people on screen? I just accept it. And also, I kind of feel like when you're mixed, you just kind of look really cool with whatever you see. You just want a fair representation of every minority. But... When it comes to an anime, I just usually, like, the, I never blame the actor. I'm never like, well, it's the, like, I would never blame Scarlett Johansson for p playing that character. I would just be like, the person in charge of the film made that decision, so it's on them. Because she's just an actor. She's just trying to get money. Like, actors, their entire career is just based on their look. You know? Yeah. Rather than using a pre-existing story, Rather than using some actors are just like Dennis Hopper and Koopa. Midas, Midas actors? What do you mean by that? Because I don't know what, like, I mean, like, what is, what is a, what does Mita mean? I assume that then John as Luigi, he didn't even have a mustache. <laughs> yeah. Had the golden touch. Oh, okay. Okay. I get you. I get you. Yeah. Yeah, there's just... Yeah. I also feel like... Sorry, Gary, that you're, now you're on here. I mean, what is your take on Native Americans? Like, what is your opinion on that? Because... I'm not Native American. I've never been immersed in the culture. So I don't know whether or not they are being portrayed accurately on screen mustache uh, no I got what you mean um these they're either I I see them these days they're either like very wise and you know all knowing or they're just I don't know generalized within just like they are just Native American that's it you know that's what I always see on screen never like they are human and they are Native American they are Native American and then a person. <laughs> That's what I feel like I see. But like, I don't know. Sometimes we make people become possessed by things that they are instead of considering them to be people. Or, unless, of course, I'm wrong. But like I said, I don't know. Like, I've, I've never been immersed in Native American culture. I've never really seen what it's like, and I don't know what the average Native American struggle Smoke signals is cringeworthy, but still, you have to watch, like, TV. Ah, uh, I see. You know what I feel like the certain groups who never, like, I, I just feel like are never represented correctly are, like, homosexuals in general. Like, I don't know how well represented they are on TV or film. And that's, that's another thing. I And I, I don't know if it's like, can I make that statement? Because is it accurate? Maybe they are being accurately portrayed. I don't know. There we go, finally. Yeah. 
Because I don't want to... I don't know. I, don't, I, I just feel like the biggest issue when we... Well, cross that. Sorry, I have to like... Just hitting my ass. Sorry. Reiterate. Yeah, I'm gonna die. That's cool. That's me, that's me. That's my fault, bro. Could you imagine if I came out of this? I would be amazed. I would be the player of the game. Alright. Dead. I can read your thing. I cannot read it on the screen. Um. Very rarely are name is appeared accurately on screen. Films are difficult to get. Smoke signals is cringeworthy, but still a good idea of res like there's a couple of girls who have a truck that only drives in reverse. Gives chances to run out. It's kind of running running gag, but like it's really how bad poverty is on a reservation. That's interesting. I will have to check these movies out. Smoke signals. All right. Um. Because, yeah, I'm glad you said that. I'm, I'm glad you said that. Because I think when, you know, I, when ever minorities are portrayed, we tend to make them very wise as if to make up for the fact that they are a minority, as if that is a crush, you know? Because that's all I kind of saw when I would watch I'll handle this. But I will have to check out. I'll handle this. I'll handle this. I like how the go back to like this really nice memory with him and Sakura, and then it goes back and he's like, I'm gonna kill you now! Like, what? This, by the way, this is one human being that he's killing. Like this. Alright. My friend's family is super native here. And they are... I'm, I'm not making fun of the way you talk, by the way. I've never heard you talk. This is just how I talk when I read. I just wanted to say that before you're, like, offended by the way I read things. Um, and they are either very buff or very fat, and that's because their bodies are designed to take in nutrients from protein. Or fat in a large way. But as for personality, normal people, but as for culture, they, have, they know a lot about animals. As for being wise, that's really an offensive stereotype for some reason. That took a while to type. <laughs> I could feel how long. <laughs> Trick. <laughs> Dang. All Scottish people are vampires. All right. <laughs> yeah. Okay. See, I. Every time I explain this to a friend or something, like, 
I'm always like, no, I always feel like in movies, they either make like homosexuals, black people, Asians, natives, they always make them very wise as if to make up for the fact of they are who they are. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm so glad you solidified that because the whole time I was like, I feel like that's offensive. I feel like, because you can't just like, they can't just make a person who is, it's always like, they are this, like a person, a person first and foremost, and then who is, because that's, that's what I usually baffled by. I'm like, really? This can't just make this character a person? Um, Ben Franklin's noble savage referring to the Iroquois Federation having better fit their beds. They have to have redeeming qualities, and in a way, counterintuitive to their personality. Yeah. Well, actually, it's funny, James, because I remember having a conversation with you, and you were like, um, what's his name's portrayal of Scottish people as offensive? <laughs> and I, I was like, what? But then, when you, I mean, it's true, though. It's true. I'm not Scottish. I don't know what the accent's like, so if you're like, it's totally exaggerated, then... That must suck. But <laughs> that's who's representing the whole of your culture. <laughs> You're from the USA. I need to say no more, Miss Coletta. Yeah, that's who I am. From the USA. Um. Yes, the magical gay person has two qualities: magical or wise, or whatever, and gay, and has no other depth. Exactly. That is what I. That is exactly what I see on TV sometimes, and I'm like. I was watching one movie that I can think of where like they just made this person a human being and who is gay, you know, like just troubled like everyone else and he was gay. That was it. And that's what I want to see on screen because representation like we've gotten there, these people exist on screen, great, but now it's just accuracy is where we need to go with. You know? <laughs> Super annoying when people try to do a Norwegian accent. I can't even think of a Norwegian accent at all. It's interesting. Well, it's funny because, like, um, my mom's Korean and I kind of can see there's a bit of a difference. No, there's a very big difference between Japanese, Korean, and Chinese um, in terms of their languages, obviously, and the way they talk. And like she, she like can hold it down pretty well. She's been here a while. She's 13, so she's like can her the way she talks is really good. But her grandma, her grandma, her grammar is weird, and because of that, it messes me up sometimes. But other than that, like. It still gets across, or like, still get certain words mixed up, like recycle, garbage, and compost. We have a compost at our house, and she'll get those words mixed up because they are technically essentially have similar functions, but get like weird. And then the other day, she was saying accident, accident, so many times that she was like, action, action. <laughs> and like, she had a whole like pause and then do like say the word. But, yeah, I mean, some people have some pretty heavy accents. And, like, when I ever, when I hear Korean, it's like a lot of duh, blah, like, duh, duh, and ar, and, like, that's what I hear. And then Chinese is a little airy sounding, and then Japanese, I think it's very precise. Uh, let's get straight to the biscuits. And that's what I think when I hear those voices. Um has an English accent even though he's Scottish. I wanna say it's not like that I'm... Okay, Victor in Fear the Walking Dead. Okay, cool, cool. Gordon Ramsay has an English accent even though he's Scottish. Oh, I see. Well, I'm gonna have to end the stream because it's been two hours and I have to go to the bathroom. <laughs>
So, um, thank you for watching Comic T, Garyan, James Rogers. We had a very informative chat. I am informed. Good luck with school, James. Not that you'll need it. You seem to be having a pretty good time eating cake. Um, yeah, I will leave like I always do. Um, Tomaki, good luck with the hurricane. Please keep us filled in on that because I am. Not, I'm. I. I would like to know what would ha like what's gonna happen. Um, <laughs> now I'm very concerned. Um. And Gary, and good luck with your job, because I know that you have a job now, and you're doing some stuff, and you're super cool now. You were talking about moving closer to the city and things like that, and I can't remember if you told me if you ever did, but I know when you originally got the job, you're talking about it. So we can talk about it on this. Um, bye, guys. Have a good day. See you when I see you. <laughs> bye.